when we're somewhere in between, we just call me love, love a friend. friend. I guess it is what it is. Tell me what's going on yeah. Girl, this may not be your favorite song Cause baby, every week you switch up Switch, switch up. So make up your mind and let's make love Let's see Let's see Let's see to the people babe Hello. good morning y'all so we are partially dressed well all the way dressed but like athleisure. we just got on athleisure because we're about to run about 10 minutes away to go to this place called donut bar and um we're gonna try some of their artisan donuts <laughs> they're donuts. huge they're too big, man. like they make donuts with pop tarts in the middle it's it's wild. We're gonna get you some footage of it though. Yeah. So we'll see yeah, what we'll you know get. How it goes. Today we're kind of grazing this morning because we have a buffet Bacchanal. that we're gonna go to. The Bacchanal Buffet is back open at Caesar's Palace. And it's I am like ready. The world's best. I think buffet. I'm ready. I'm getting my stomach ready. Yeah. This is why I can't be stuff. slim and fit. Right. My thing is Right. What? I'm just talking about I was agreeing with you, like me, like I can't be slim and fit. This ain't got nothing to do with you. It he ain't trying all about to come you. for me, y'all. It ain't all about you, sweetie. It is. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. <laughs> Don't worry about it. All right, let's go. You're doing the most. <laughs> hey, lit this morning. This is how we do. Like, like it's Friday. Night. It's Friday night. Friday night. It's Friday night. It's Friday night. It's Friday night. The party's here on the west side. So here's the donut bar out in Las Vegas. This place, we um, found out about it on a YouTube video. Everybody who went to Vegas visited this spot, so we had to check it out ourselves. Um, this place has every type of donut, you name it. Like, they literally have it. One in particular that B and I were interested in was the one with the Pop-Tart in it. So we tried that one. Then they had a special one there that day that was a grilled cheese donut, which is this right here. Uh, don't judge. It's sweet and savory. It was actually really, really good. Brittany was judging me at first, but it was really, really good. It's not too sweet. Why can't it? Some cheese popping. It's a whole dramatization. You know, just explore. Well, Brittany might gamble. If I get the itch. Brittany got an addiction now. Y'all should have never let me win. She cute Vester Jr. <laughs> So contrary to what it looks like on her face, she actually likes the donut. <laughs> uh, the donuts are really good there. Uh, she got a coffee. She had to get a coffee to go with it. So 
we enjoyed ourselves there so we're on our way back to the hotel we got to get some pool time in before uh, we head off to the longest walk of my life y'all oh my god but let's get some shots of this place here doing sitting here just uh charging our phones and resting <laughs> i asked bruce because my friend who's here a client and a wax technician so i found her online when i was looking for a black wax tech and then when she found out i do nails we like patronize each other and pretty much cross promote and send people to each other i asked bruce is it weird for him that <laughs> he hanging out with somebody who's seen all parts of me. I thought about it the whole time. <laughs> you just didn't want to say nothing? with my brother about that. I was like, bro, this girl waxes my girl. She just seen her whole ass. Like, <laughs> it, it is what it is. Is bro. it weird to you? It is. It's kind of weird. 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 But, what if it was like an ex-boyfriend that you was around? I don't even think it would be that weird. Really? <laughs> you know, I, people have been around ex-boyfriends plenty of times. But you don't know how to act. But with another woman, it's just like. It's not like I've been with her. You know, know another it's woman. Like, it's just like, wow. You just like, don't seen the whole. From the rooter to the tutor. From the front to the back. <laughs> this is what it is. We just left the donut bar. Recommend it. Yeah. 10 out of 10. Even that savory pretty donuts pretty was good. Pretty pretty was pretty good. good. She laughed at me for getting it. I did, because we're at a donut place. I'm thinking, get some sweet stuff. But then, like, even when I ate mine, nice. I was like, oh, this is too much. So we're about to go downstairs and out the door to peruse Fremont. Then we're going to come back, put on our bathing suits to get some more pool time in. Yeah. At 3, we're going to go link promenade. to the Link Promenade and peruse around down there. And then 5 o'clock. We're going to the Bacchanal Buffet, which I probably are tired of hearing us talk about, but we're highly excited. excited. And after that, we probably go to Caesar's Farm Shops, which is going to be weird because I wanted to go there to eat gelato over the bridge, but we're going to just leave the buffet, so I probably won't be eating gelato. I just want to sit over the bridge. Gonna eat I might have an espresso. Like You're going to eat gelato for me. Stop playing yourself. We'll see. <laughs> Bro, do y'all hear the detail of how she got to have the gelato over the bridge? Like, and if she don't get it that way, she's not going to Bro, it. I live for moments. No, because we were in a mall yesterday and Bruce was like, oh, that go gelato. And I was like, yeah, I know, but I want it where I want it from. Even when I said I want to go on the link at night. On the high roller? Yeah, on the high roller at night. Because I know, I know what I want to see. And I know, like, it's going to look good on, on vlog for y'all. And I just want to experience it more at night because the city is so pretty at night. It's beautiful in the daytime, but at night it's just, it's like Christmas lights, but it's not Christmas. That's fine. But I'm just saying, if you don't get it your way, it breaks you to the core. Like It don't break me to the okay. core, but I, I, am, okay. I am very, very sad and I get frustrated a little bit. Like parasol down last night, it, was played out to perfection. it did not let me down at it all, out to perfection. and it was just like a beautiful, beautiful moment. It felt amazing out there. It did like, it like <sighs> that joint was, was back backyard the goals. Like mm -hmm. It really is like an oasis, like an escape from. You can forget where you are back there. Yeah, like it don't feel like. Well, I guess it still feel like Vegas because it's kind of, you know. No, but you can still get nice, but because how high the trees and the waterfall mm -hmm. and the water and the way it's cascaded out. Basically, it's a sensory immersion because, mm -hmm. like, you can't see any part of the strip. You can't hear any part of the strip. Like, I ain't hear nothing other than the water and the shows when it was happening and the conversation of the people around us. And it was, like, super duper dope. It's bad, man. <laughs> Do something to you. But yeah, so that's what's going on. All right. We'll check back in with y'all later.
All right, so this time at the pool was a little bit different. It was super packed. Thank God we're vaccinated. So we're on our way to the Bacchanal Buffet now in Caesar's Palace. And word to the wise, just uh, valet park. It's easier. Just have the money for it. It's only like $25, $30 each place that you go to. I know that seems like a lot, but trying to find parking is hell. But uh, it's beautiful in this casino, guys. We had a little wait, even though we had reservations. That was kind of different. So when you thought having reservations meant you weren't going to have to wait anymore. Anything? be honest with you guys Brittany and I were super excited about the Bacchanal buffet we were just excited about Vegas buffets in general um, there was a lot to choose from at this buffet this is probably the best buffet in Vegas they have every uh, I guess you could say different uh, every cuisine that you can ask for Italian Asian American you name it it's uh, Mediterranean they have it all but contrary uh, to what we were thinking, it was a little bit underwhelming. And I don't know if that had anything to do with uh, COVID protocol or anything, but the food was just meh, you know. But, I mean, the experience was well worth it. This is a beautiful, beautiful place on the inside, but the food looked all right. All right, so now we're off to the beautifulest, longest waste of time of my life. I'm just kidding, guys. But Brittany thought that the place that we were looking for, the gelato place, was inside of uh, Caesars. We were sadly mistaken. And that was just partially because the ceiling looks the same as where it was actually located, which was in the Venetian. So we kind of went on a wild goose chase, and we were walking through the whole Caesars Palace uh, shops, I guess you could say, trying to find it, and we didn't find it, so we were like, well, let's just go to Link Promenade and go get on the um, uh, the high roller, because it was almost sundown. We actually looked up what time sundown was going to be coming, and we wanted to make sure we were on there at nighttime so we can get the full, full effect of the high roller. This was a long walk as well. I'm telling you guys, my feet was literally smoking by the time we got back to the hotel room. Guys, this right here is extremely beautiful. You can see every hotel and on the strip of Las Vegas. You can also even see downtown Las Vegas. Um, it's amazing. They let you know when you get to the tippy, tippy top. We took a picture once we got there. 
There was a lot of people inside of the little capsule with us here, so it's kind of hard to get a little spot to videotape, but we made the best of it. So now we finally made it to the Venetian. And when I tell you guys, we caught hell getting into the Venetian, guys. We caught hell. Literally, I felt like I was like crawling trying to get into this place because the, they had these little escalator walk path things on their little ramps and they didn't work. So you had to like literally climb up hills to get inside this hotel. So we're still speculating to see if the place actually is in here but we had to find the gondolas. And that was kind of a task on its own there because you had to go through all their shops in order to find the gondolas. But once we found them, guys, it was very, very beautiful. So as you guys can see, I was completely over it. Brittany was in heaven because she got to live out the aesthetic that she had planned for. But uh, as you see, we're on our way back home now. And I cannot wait to see that Circa Hotel. <laughs> But, uh, man, you guys got to get out to Vegas, man. It's beautiful out here. It's a lot of walking, but it's beautiful. And, um, yeah, but see you guys next time in uh, the last part here. Later. Later.